is the ultimate way to make your plastic look awesome. Now we have many different methods that we use. More are cost effective, but this is absolutely the best way to treat your plastic. You see how nasty that mud flap looks, all dirty? First with our 99% rubbing alcohol, and you just soak it down. You can do the inside of the mud flap in here as well. And you just soak it down and let it set, and then we're going to go jump over on our door handle and show you how to do that as well. Now you can prop this up if you want, so it's up out of the way. I'm not going to do that. I'm going to hold it up while I do it to speed the video up a little bit. First we do is we take our 99%, put it on a cloth, and you just clean it. Make sure there's nothing on it. You have to do it a couple of times maybe. If you put your 303 or your transmission fluid on it from another video that we did. See how quick that evaporates? It's pulling every bit of oil out of that plastic. And all you do is put your ceramic coating on. I usually put it on one end. And you just go over it. Now if you like the shine, you'll leave it just like that. Look how gorgeous that looks. We're out in the sun, so this will dry quick. That's it. And it will stay looking that gorgeous for a long, long years. Years and years. Now the easiest way to do this, of course, is with the mud flap off. But I'm sharing this with you for those that do not want to pull their mud flaps off. And this process I'm doing right here goes for all the plastic on your vehicle. Your running boards, your bumper plastic, it doesn't matter. Plastic around your side mirrors. And by doing this, you will create a situation where you're not constantly cleaning them. The dirt and dust will wash right off with just a slight rain or hit it with the garden hose and it's clean. I put it on real heavy on this type of plastic. And if you get in, in tight areas, I've got this loosened up so I can push it back a little bit. But if you get in tight areas, you can always use a Q-tip to get around the corners and the edges. Now you can do this a couple times and the more you do it on this rougher plastic like this, the smoother it'll look. And of course, the longer it will last. But this will stay beautiful like this for years. And these mud flaps here are 10 years old way better than clear coat because clear coat does not repel dirt and water spots and dust way better than paint because that peels off there you go my friends gorgeous from that right there to this to that